Previously on Alan Wake. It's not a lake. It's an ocean. After saving my wife from the mysterious dark presence, I found myself trapped in the dark place. Imagination can be the enemy here. A nightmarish world that exists somewhere beyond the shores of our own existence. We're the one making all this happen. Just do what Zane tells you. Follow the signal. Is all this really coming out of my head? The dark place playing tricks on you. I made my way across its ever-shifting landscape, trying to reach Thomas Zane. If you're trapped in your own nightmares, you're still going deeper. It's all in your head. You've been making it up. Really? Your delusions are out of control. Get out of my head. Seriously, Al? You need to get a grip. You know reality's different here. See what I mean? Al? Al? Ugh. I think I'm stuck on this side. Well, you're gonna have to find your way out of there. I'll wait. Just remember, you're still in the dark place. You know that, right? I don't want to alarm you, pal, but it's sink or swim time. Fine. I could feel the pressure mounting. Barry was right. Time was running out. Everything I saw was a dark, twisted version of reality based on my memories and thoughts. I had to accept it. If all of this was from my mind, then I was the one making all this happen. I was literally fighting myself. It was a moment of clarity. After finishing departure, I felt finished myself. All I had wanted was to save Alice. After that, a part of me had been ready to just give in and die. But I hadn't given up. Thomas Sane had reached me. I had run across a nightmarish landscape following a signal from him. He kept telling me I was sinking, going too deep. I wasn't sure if he meant the dark place or insanity. Perhaps it was Nice job, Al! So, you really are nuts, huh? Let's face it, we always knew this was coming. I guess, but I actually feel pretty rational, all things considered. Crazy people don't know they're crazy. That's where they're crazy. Hey, check out the light show behind the lodge. That's Zane's light. Yeah, you're done sinking now. That means he's just about caught up with you. You better go talk to him.
Lots of fireworks here. Nice. Wake heard the old gods play. Music came out all wrong. It attracted the horrors. Oh, hell yeah. Remember this, Al? Inside now, Al. The big guy busted down the door. This is just a memory. Even your memories are complicated. Uh, yeah. So, I guess you're gonna need to talk to Zane out there now that he's actually here. I'm just gonna, you know, let you non-imaginary people talk in peace. You're not coming? Nah, that was a crutch, you know. Hey, you're moving up in the world, buddy! You have done well, Alan. Now I can accompany you. You are trapped in your own dream. You must wake yourself up, but first, you have to reach yourself. The cabin? Yes, my cabin. It will not be easy. Your previous work can help you. I still have some pages of your manuscript left. Words like that have power here.
the lighthouse? It's very appropriate. I can help you reach it. But after that, you will be on your own. I cannot enter the cabin now. The Dark Presence made sure of that on our last encounter. You are facing yourself, the parts of your mind that are hard to control. This is not a fight anyone else can win for you. Okay, that's different. He knew the terrain, such as it was, but a part of me wondered if he was even human anymore, after so many years in this place. The world was tilted! It was turning upside down! Wake was lost! He would fall! He couldn't tell which way was up! He would die here, torn apart by the whirlwind! Too high. Too high! At this height, the water would be like hitting concrete. You can't want me dead this the bad. The storm was coming! It would throw him off! <laughs> 